as, as occupational therapist is very, very broad, so we're dealing with all aspects of daily life. So it can be anything from sort of entering the front door to perhaps getting in and out of the bath or using toileting facilities. It's not just about their functional ability, it's also about the way an environment will affect somebody mentally, psychologically. I was in a hell of a lot of pain, didn't know where to turn, to be honest. Um, couldn't do a lot. I couldn't stand up for a long time, like in the kitchen or anything like that. And I was getting very depressed. Going up the stairs, first of all, was on my hands and knees. And there was many a time I'd get up so far from the top, lie down on the stairs and I'd say to him, pain's terrible, I've got a rest here. The more experienced you are on the job and the more time you spend out in people's homes and, and completing these assessments, you get to know what works and what doesn't work. Um, because everybody's an individual and everybody presents very differently. Probably the, the main frustration is uh, the length of time it can take from, um, from us recommending the adaptation until it actually gets put in. Well, we just don't have enough housing stock and we don't have enough accessible housing stock and we don't have enough truly affordable housing stock. So like I had a, a client recently who uh, I recommended a stair lift for and it was clear when I did my assessment that there was a need for a stair lift. Um, but they've now, it's sort of progressed through the next stages um, and they've said it's not going to be until sort of early next year. And this lady, I think she's going to have a lot of difficulty managing on the stairs between now and then. I had the shower this year and they, it took about nine months to get it. Um, they come in and they were brilliant. At no time did I feel as if I was, because I'm a person that don't like charity. But no time did I think that it was charity I was getting. You know, as she said, you need this and this is what you've got to have. I think the, the most rewarding parts are definitely the satisfaction you get, um, particularly when you review someone who um, you've seen back maybe a few months ago, you've seen how difficult something was for them in their house. Without them, I don't know what I'd have done, you know, because they were so helpful. All these things you don't know is out there to the put. I mean, I've seen people with these, but then I've also got something in the garage that wheels along and it's a seat as well. And that enables me to go out into the garden and I can sit down. I love pruning. Mm -hmm. So I can wheel, sit down and prune. You know, and I think it was about a fortnight before it was all in and done. And one of the best things they did for me really was.